Hi there, I'm Daryl Williams from FandangleProductions.com uh, This is a video that I'm doing for uh, for Python bikes so I have a second another uh, YouTube channel called Python Bikes so uh, the next series of tutorials that I'll be pr uh, producing on Python Bytes will be about uh, building websites with Python uh, using what's called web frameworks. Now there's quite a few web frameworks that you can use. Uh, most popular one is the Django. Uh, then a lot of people using Flask, uh, Cherry Pie, and uh, I had problems trying to uh, understand the concept of uh, how a Python web framework works, how, uh, what the process is. I, I just couldn't get my head around how it was done. Um, and then I came across a, a small web framework, a micro web framework, it's called Bottle. And I finally got it. A bottle made it really easy to understand the concept or methods that Python uses uh, in creating a, a uh, website. Uh, so previous tutorial was using WX Python widgets um, and but uh, one restriction with those uh, with the program that type of program is it's on your computer. So if you have a network, which I've got set up here at home, if you have a network and you go onto another computer, you can't access that program. And I also build uh, database web uh, database programs, um, and realised that um, by having a program using WX Python, uh, it's restricted to one computer that has that program. Um, I didn't want to use a complex, uh, what would you call it, a complex dynamic website such as WordPress, which is huge. Uh, there's a big learning curve with that. I wanted to be able to control it myself. Uh, then uh, you could use an Apache server, which I'm using on a couple of my computers uh, with the Linux operating system, and you can use MySQL database. Uh, with Bottle, you can use uh, SQLite 3, an SQLite database, and so I thought I would share what I've been learning, and as I'm learning, I'll provide more tutorials in helping you understand how to understand uh, the web frameworks, uh, Python web frameworks. So as I said, the following series will be about that. And yes, the reason why I've chosen to explain how to use Bottle is because it's a very easy web framework to understand and uh, understand the concept of routes or routing, uh, clicking your URL which will take you to a, a static page or you can generate a dynamic page using SQLite and down the track you can then use a larger database uh, which would be MySQL and also uh, connecting, I haven't tested this as yet, but connecting uh, Bottle uh, to uh, an Apache server and just see how it copes with the uh, a small network and how many connections it can have. Um, I'm also using doing experiments in creating a media center on a server uh, so that people who are connected to my network can access those videos and select whatever video they want to watch. Uh, so that's a, a project that I'm really interested in doing. So I hope you enjoy the following series of uh, tutorials on how to build a website using Python. I'm Daryl Williams from FandangleProductions.com uh, and this video will be on Python Bytes. If you have any questions, comments, uh, any thank yous, please leave a comment on my YouTube channel where this video will be shown. If you have any questions, please ask them and I will answer them as soon as possible. 
Okay, hope you enjoyed. We're looking forward to these tutorials. Until then, have a good day. Goodbye.